Jesse Yawn has been singing the blues for 50 years now, and photojournalist Tom Weinkoop has his story. Georgia. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Georgia. I was heavily rooted in the church. The radio, I guess, would be probably the beginning of it all. Right, way down south here in Dixon, lay down some of that crazy sound. The stuff was filling this little boy's soul. Even back then, I knew that I wanted to sing the blues. Of course, they wonder why the car didn't start the next day because little Jesse had run the batteries down, but they didn't know who was doing it. Help me. I can't do it all by myself. Help me, baby. I can't do it all by myself. You don't have to help me. I'm going to find somebody else. My whole life is uh, somewhat given through song because when things happen to me, I found myself writing about them. Hey! He's just a phenomenal talent. He's just one of these undiscovered treasures. Other blues men, when they fully acknowledge his gifts and his genius and talent, and then they say, why isn't this man a superstar? Whatever. If I were Donald Trump, I'd probably bankroll a couple of CDs uh, for, for Jesse. He's a stylist. He reminds you of a lot of different people, but you can hear the pure Jesse in his style, and you can hear the grittiness in it. My first full release was Forevermore. And that's the album that I have out here now. We've been all over the United States playing blues in places, top flight places, to some real dirt floor type places. Jesse Young appears on a, a, a CD recently of, of Kelly Bell, who's an up and coming artist. These people, they're ready for the blues. Jesse Kelly is the bridge. He knows the blues and deliver it so that the younger generation can understand it and appreciate it. Jesse's always been a puzzle to me why Jesse hasn't been discovered. I am totally thrilled to just have the privilege of sitting here and listening to Jesse sing. I'm gonna love you all over. It's like this old foyer here. We've both done a lot of traveling. I want to max it out before I'm done with it. Only takes a little bit to get the last mile. Just like this old boy here, it's not really, really to retire.